What's up, Flavor Squad? It's your girl, Fashionisha, here to give you all the flavor. If you are new here, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe. If you are not new here, I thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Today, we're making a denim corset top. And these are the materials that you will need. So first, you want to prepare your fabric. I got this fabric from a thrift store. It was just maybe a half a yard a yard. I don't really know about looking. <laughs> But I just got this from the thrift store and I decided to make a corset top out of it. I'm first measuring my top out 30 inches. And later on, I actually changed that measurement. I'll let you guys know later on in the video what I changed. But I just want to get the length of the top to 30 inches right now to go around my full waist. I'm now just cutting off those rugged edges, but later on, we're gonna create those rugged edges, so just stay tuned. Now I'm measuring out the height that I want my top to be how long i actually want it not the width i wanted that to be about 18 inches in length so that's why i cut off that extra excess fabric now here i just spread out the fabric and marked my midpoint and my halfway points on both sides and i did this because we're going to put strips on the sides so you want to measure out the midpoint of that top and also the side points. My midpoint was 16 inches and my side points were eight inches from 16. So I counted forward eight inches and that was the right and I counted backward eight inches and that was the left point. Now I'm cutting out my strips that are gonna go on the sides on the two points, the two side points we made. These strips are gonna go on those two side points. And I actually made these two strips too long. You should want your strips to be about 10 inches long. Now we'll just place our strips onto those two side points that we made. We're gonna pin these together. Then you want to just pin those to your fabric. We're gonna sew with our sewing machine straight down in the middle of that seam, in the middle of that piece of fabric. Not on the edges, dead set in the middle. We're then gonna bring our side seams in and sew right on the edge of that for both sides. Notice how I'm sewing only in the middle of this strip of fabric, not on the side of the fabric. We need the side of that strip of fabric. And on this, I'm sewing on the inside seam of this fabric, not on the end and not in the middle. We need that space.
and this is what we need the space for we're going to attach our whole i don't know what these things are called i'm not even gonna lie with y'all <laughs> lie to y'all but we're gonna attach these and this is what our string will go through to tighten the corset i got this tool from amazon i'll be sure to link this tool down below and they send you the little thingies i don't know the name i should know that huh they're gonna send you those as well and they'll send you instructions on how to use it this is what the hole should look like once you finish attaching your metal pieces This is what we needed those strips for. We're going to simply cut slits on each side of those strips. You don't want to cut your stitch, so just be sure not to go too close to your stitch, but we're just going to cut little slits all the way down those strips, both strips. I lost the footage, but we're also going to cut those same slits at the top and the bottom of the corset. And after that, you want to run it through the washer and dryer, and when you're finished, you'll get this finished product. At this point, we're basically done. Now you want to take some string. I'm using just some black yarn as my string. And you want to lace it up through your top. Leaving the bow at the bottom or the top is up to you. I left my bow to be tied at the bottom. And there you have it, guys. We have a denim corset top. This is just so cute. And I cannot wait to style this top. I'm looking for some white pants. So if you have any suggestions, let me know. Flavor Squad, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Make sure you guys like it up. Make sure you guys subscribe. Let me know what you think below. Let me know if you will wear this out or not. Thank you guys so much. May your curls pop and your grinds never stop. Bye, Flavor Squad.